in both instances of extreme hurt, the polarity is that's where the extreme good is at or like the extreme joy, right? Because to be so close to the bottom, on the other side of the bottom is the top. And now in order for you to get there, you really have to like, I sunk through the bottom. Like I sunk through the bottom. So I broke the barriers so of consciousness that it's like, when I said like, when people say raise your vibration, raise your frequency, it's a literal meaning. It's not like, oh yeah, if you just um, eat fruits and berries all day, uh, you'll, you know, woof de woof. Like, yeah, that'll definitely help because most people eating that bullshit anyway. Like, 3D printed meat, just cancerous shit, just food be having maggots, parasites in it, all type of, all type of all that shit. So, though, yes, yeah, so like, that's the polarity. In both instances of extreme pain, right? On the other side of that, there was the joy. Now, having the discernment and the mental fortitude, you know, to continue to fight, to continue to push through, that's different, you know, because we all go through bullshit. Like, ain't, ain't nobody life perfect. Everybody go through their struggles, adversity, turmoil. The thing is, though, you can't quit. Like, you gotta, like, hope. Even though hope being that you don't have it, in a sense, hope is what inspires people to keep going. So if you gotta believe have a strong so. soul, a strong spirit, you know, a strong sense of self, a strong sense of being, you're going to want to continue to do better. And in turn, you are going to push through those barriers, to break through those levels of consciousness, to talk to your God self, to your higher self. And... It usually takes some form of pain, some form of trauma, you know what I mean? To really bring that shit out of people. Like everybody that's, uh, you know, that's really calm, really serene, really indulged in peace, they all experienced, uh, you know, something in their life that was traumatic to make them want to be like, yeah, you know what? I need to keep this shit on the wraps because I ain't trying to go there because a nigga get out, a nigga get out of character once I go there. And, you know what I mean? But having the ability to turn that shit on and off, kind of like the Hulk, right? Like the Hulk on Marvel Avengers. When they finally asked him, they were like, "What's the secret?" And he was like, "I'm always angry." But he he made peace with that, like the yin and the yang. It was like he he accepted what is. He accepted his being. And I, I believe it's Infinity War or Endgame. We got the big Hulk. Nigga, big as fuck, smart as fuck, with his fucking glasses on. You can't fuck with him, so. You know what I mean? Even though shit might be hard, you know what I mean? Relationship ain't working, friendships ain't working, you know what I mean? Somebody like, please like tell rock me no bottom. Name. Eh. That rock bottom, in order for, for a new foundation to be built, the old foundation must be destroyed. So, you ain't being buried, you being planted, man. Peace.